What's up everyone, I'm Stonewall. Today we're gonna to be looking at the dessert truck from Laws. It is set number 1738 and has 582 pieces. Let's build it. So another minifigure scale vehicle from Laws is food truck lineup. If you're not familiar with Laws, their bricks are about 75% the size of Lego. I really like some things about this set, but there are definitely some things I don't really like that much. So let's take a closer look. So the dessert truck is obviously the main part of the build here. It reminds me of kind of like an old Studebaker, probably before it was converted. Um, obviously it's painted pink and white. Get that dessert sugary effect going on for the clients. Starting up top, there is a pretty cool cupcake build here, and I really like these donut guys. Um, they're obviously big stickers, but I like how this guy's all happy, and this guy seems kind of worried. He's even crying. I guess he's about to be sold and eaten. But yeah, I really like the top of this truck. Uh, this, this set has a lot of stickers like the other food trucks, but generally that works pretty well. There's only a few places that um, like that's not very necessary. Um, that is a printed piece on the dish, though. Looking at this first side, we have a nice sweet donuts sign here. A little menu on the side here showing what they offer. A little sticker on the door. And then this counter actually pulls out for our benefit. That swings out. You can see there's a croissant, a little cupcake, and a couple donuts on the shelf there. And then you see the store owner is back there. There is a little sticker on the cutting board there. She's making up some dough for the next batch. Swing that back in there. Coming around the back, there is a set of shutters here on this window. Um, I guess they used an old home window when they built this. There is a little flower bed on the back as well. And then your standard kind of bumper and grill pieces and all that. Come around this side, you see the counter with the register. I don't know why it's pointing that way. I would think it would be pointing the other way for the shop owner. There is a couple cookies here and then a giant, uh, I'm not sure what this is, just some kind of giant dessert thing. And then a little shake here, I guess, blueberry shake. I like the build for the front of this car. Uh, it has that kind of slope back and 
Also has a nice bumper to go along with the grill. Um, side mirrors are nice in a different color. So the main problem I have with this set is that it's just kind of delicate. It seems like there's always something that's about to fall off. Um, that wheel just fell off. These wheel well pieces are just on one stud. So they always wanted to come off like that. Um, this thing always comes off. This little counter piece. Um, these donut pieces are really loose in. Yeah, so that's kind of a shame. Another thing is that this set doesn't want to roll, and that's because these tires are just on like a half Technic pin here. So they don't want to roll. As you can see, it does not want to roll at all, which is a shame. All the other food trucks in this lineup roll really nicely. So that's kind of a shame. I should have just used the same building technique that they did on the other ones. Oh, so I just found out that the roof here is actually on just a couple jumper plates. So it is pretty easy to get on and off and get that minifigure in and out. So that's nice, but it still doesn't roll at all. So taking a closer look at the shop owner, the first thing that's pretty obvious is that they sent me a minifigure head that wasn't printed. It is just a blank head, which is really a bummer. So no face printed on this one. Um, kind of looks like a mannequin, but I'm just going to leave her in the truck, so probably won't notice. She has her apron on as she's busy making sweets to sell. She has this, another one of these plastic little aprons. Uh, they're not as nice as those cloth ones that Lego has. Other than that, she has a nice hair piece. And then we also get this customer. Um, looks like a child. He comes on this little scooter build. Um, but he snaps in there and looks really good. He's super happy about getting that milkshake or whatever smoothie that is. Taking a closer look, he's wearing some khakis and has a light teal hoodie on. He's holding that milkshake drink and you can see his tongue sticking out. Super happy about that. So all in all, it's a okay set, I guess. I really like the brick built things on top. I love the graphics for these little donut guys. And the styling looks pretty good on it. I really like this little scooter guy. I think he looks really good. Super happy. One thing that really sucks about the set is they didn't give me that face, printed face piece for the one minifigure. And also it just kind of, it's a little delicate. There's a lot of one stud connections, which can fall apart pretty easily. Uh, but mainly it just, it doesn't roll at all. They have these rim pieces just connect to one of those half, they're stud on one side, Technic pin on the other side pieces, and it just doesn't roll, which sucks because it's a food truck. You, you'd want it to roll. And the rest of the ones in the lineup do roll, so that's just a bummer. So it's not my favorite set. Uh, let me know what y'all thought about it in the comments. Be sure to check out the other videos of the Better Food Tricks on my channel. Otherwise, be sure to subscribe so you can catch the next video.